This is out of Hickory. A seven year old child is dead after he was shot and killed in the car with his mother. It happened along the 1900 block of Tate Boulevard Southwest a few minutes after 11 last night. The boy was rushed to Catawba Valley Medical Center where he later died. The suspect is still at large. WCNC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez is in Hickory right now where the tragedy took place. Tanya, how is the child's family and classmates dealing with such a horrible loss? I mean, I don't even want to begin to think about how this family is dealing right now. I can't even imagine it. You know, we're both parents. I don't even want to think about it. The school itself is deeply in mourning. Even the teachers were brought to tears today. I'm going to show you, though, where this all went down because we're standing here at the scene of where it happened. So according to police, the mom was actually here in this far lane and then switched over to the lane closer here, right in front of another car that got apparently upset. According to the mother, they pulled around beside her, started yelling out the window, and then and that's when she saw the gun. A seven year old precious, beautiful boy in second grade was murdered last night. That precious boy, Zakylan Harris, was one of the special ones. Family friends called him Kai. His teachers say he was sweet, kind, loved by his friends, always had a smile or a hug to share. And we especially love our students. Excuse me, it's very hard to lose a child. I can't imagine. Hickory police say Zakylan was in the backseat of his mom's SUV with his two little brothers, just six and one, heading home Wednesday night. Traffic cameras show their car here. We circled it in blue, turning onto Tate Boulevard just after 11 o'clock. The dark SUV here behind them. Police say just after they got out of frame, the mom accidentally cut the SUV off. She then heard a female yelling at her from the other vehicle. The SUV then pulled around to the side of Zakylan's car, police say, and his mom said she saw someone reach around and then she saw the muzzle of a gun. This was a senseless act of violence. There's, there's no excuse for this. Grief counselors at Southwest Primary today where Zakylan was in second grade. This is the third classmate these young children have lost in just two months. She gave me kisses in my hair. In February, a brother and sister died in a house fire. Now, another friend gone. It's just absolutely horrifying. I think we were all in shock. We just can't believe another innocent life has been lost. So that video came from traffic cameras, and we know there are traffic cameras that are all along this road. Police are now doing what they can to try to enhance those images to see if they can get a better look at what that car looked like and what the people look like who were inside of it. If you have any information, please call Hickory Police. Reporting live, I'm Tanya Mendez, WCNC Charlotte.